And yes, so even Minister of Labor and Employment, Chris Ngige, don't summer say President Mamadou Buhari reform for infrastructure, say it don't bring more than one million jobs. Ngige Yan, so for the Democracy Day message to Nigerians from a media aide, Emma Nzomimu, on uh, Thursday for Inside Enugu. The Minister Yan said this kind of success where they recorded for job creation and uh, saying a result of infrastructural development and a fallout of the executive order five and where the presidio signed for 2018. And instead, said the order now to improve local content for public procurement with the science, technology, plus engineering component to take create jobs for millions of unemployed Nigerians. And to follow us discuss and some matter for ground uh, about Democracy Day, we get Professor Chris Wokobia from Abuja via Zoom. We we'll greet you, sir. Oh, no, dear. Fine. Thank you, Professor. Um, uh, what do you fit to tell people where they believe, say, not only Yoruba celebration, now in this June 12 matter be? You fit summer us the national perspective where consign this matter as you take the heart? No, uh it don't tell when June 12 pass uh, only Southwest and Yoruba people celebration. It don't tell, you know. Um, make I tell you, the even when the struggle for actualization of June 12 happened uh, between 1993 and when Chief Amkwa may God bless his soul, died, mm. you know, Nigerians across the divide, Igbos, Yoruba, Zawusas, across the divide, follow fight for that actualization. Mm. The only thing will happen initially is that when this democracy comes, uh, not only uh, majorly the Southwest states, and then sometimes uh, do uh, follow the celebrate the June 12 this thing. But remember that last year, um, the president, uh, on the presidency under our current Oga Pata Pata, uh, Buhari, come make a national holiday. That is why everywhere for Nigeria today now on a public holiday in mm -hmm. honor of June 12th. Not true. And so as the matter take be like this, we they happy say at least uh, our Gonga Presido still try make this June 12th day the real democracy day because now so it's supposed to be. So how you fit look democracy as you don't they come and during by that time where we made a plan say MK Abiola for fit rule and now we be say we can't put June 12th as democracy day. How you fit access democracy so far? No, when we access democracy as a day to day, uh, anybody when get good conscience go cry, because uh, when Chief M. Kabiola, uh, when June 12, when the June 12 day synonymous with uh, uh, fight for June 12. Remember, say that campaign that time, the the mantra of in campaign a farewell to poverty. Mm. M. Kabiola that time they talk say in no one make any Nigerian go to bed without food for Mbele, mm. you know. And he did the best to electrify the campaign when uh, he take win that election, when uh, Babangida not agree. Mm -hmm. Now, if you say 27 years after and then 21 years of democracy, how we don't work at it? Uh, the answer be say we never work out well at all because democracy as it be now, be like say now only for the rich and those when they inside government, the poor today in poverty and even if they, they are people they go to bed without food in their stomach and every time now talk talk government they talk you know they see the action uh, see as we did now uh, all over the world people they talk about COVID-19 uh, the pandemic when they worry the world our medical system is not very good our roads not good not in the work school every day, every year people they go as they go strike you know so if you assess democracy as it were now. You go find out, say, uh, we never, it's not yet to rule. We never really begin work at democracy. Now civil rule will get now. You know, the thing when I all fight for, die for, uh, the thing when my colleagues and my comrades die for, fight for, uh, we never achieve them at all. Now those who will not even believe in June 12 and the struggle for June 12. Now, I'm, now them they enjoy within, we suffer, we die for, people die for. You know, but I believe say we will keep pushing. Just like uh, no, if if you told anybody three years ago, say June 12th will be national holiday across the country, then we'll tell you say how. And then if you tell them say that uh, Buhari will not be Democrat, nine go make a national holiday, then we'll tell you say not possible. But you see, 
anything when people put their heart and mind to and walk towards them strongly, then go see that achieve Now I'll be waiting with the sea. So I believe say, Nigeria will get better if we keep pushing at it. Okay. So as you don't talk like this now, Professor, we know say you be June 12th uh, uh, advocate, you be, you be activist for June 12th, and you want to make everything the, the way that democracy, where they've been planned that time, been supposed to. So looking and going forward, what thing you go advise the present administration so that they go fit copy from that mindset where that this June 12th saga been bring during by those years? The first thing when government would do is they truly believe in the June 12th when they don't make public holiday. Now to do electoral reforms. Okay. You know, June 12th become, became historically uh, a phenomenon, not be because not just data. Mm. It was because that day across the country, people come out under the rain, under the sure. sun, across the country come vote. And up to today, now that election will be the freest and the fairest for our nation's history. Yeah. So waiting people they talk, they say we want election when we be free, fair and credible okay. like June 12th. Okay. And if this government says that was why uh, in one other interview when I don't give today, mm. I tell them say if we want to truly recognize June 12th, mm. the first thing when our dear president will talk today now to tell us say. In government, will pursue electoral reforms okay. and pursue them well the way Nigerians want. Okay. Because at the core of democratic experience and practice, now the laws when they guide elections. And I do sincerely think, say, now what we first we we'll go first do if we want the spirit of June 12, you know, okay. to follow us. Okay. Then the second thing now to make sure, say, those when the governors, because I know say the reason when politics be the only big business for this country, we say. Um, the money when then they share among politicians, they too much. And okay. nobody's thinking about how they will take build infrastructure. Okay. If you look at them, like the National Assembly, for instance, okay. they're not reach 600 persons, but their budget every year pass the budget of many states. Okay. You ask yourself why. Okay. You know, the democracy is supposed to be government of the people, by the people, and for the people. But okay. for Nigeria now, democracy now the government of the rich, okay. for the rich, and by the rich. And I think the time don't reach when we will begin to think about the poor and the hungry amongst us. Not because true. now that's the essence of governance. Exactly. You know, if we not go on, if we not go on, the spirit of June 12, we could be say we deceive ourselves when we celebrate June 12. Not true. So, Professor Okobia, you try you, you too much. Thank you all the way from Abuja. Say you fit contribute uh, inside our Ogbonge Pigeon News on top of Democracy Day. Come give us this Ogbonge information. Thank you so much. I make you get a better day. Thank you so much. Yes.